We'll move on to our Community Impact Hero. The next award is, of course, for that Community Impact. Cabell Brand, have you heard of him? He spent his entire adult life helping people to lift themselves out of poverty, claim their potential, and human dignity. He is a name many of you have already heard before today. When he started his efforts, this wasn't necessarily a popular thing to do, but Cabell felt strongly that it was the right thing to do, and now he's respected as a leader who helped change both destinies and attitudes for the good of us all. So let's have a closer look at Cabell Brand. My ultimate goal is very simple, to exhort by example and challenge the current generation. The words Cabell Brand lives by. Create, sustain, and strengthen the American society. One of the things that I decided early on in my life after the war that I needed to do locally, I've been spending about 20% of my time doing something in the community for those 50 years until I sold my business in 1986, now I spend 100% of my time. It's a major thing I do. A word he doesn't live by or even use, retire. Brent says there's just too much to do. There's so much more that needs to be done. I mean, look at the turmoil on health care. Look at the millions of people that don't have health care. There's so many problems who look at the absence of jobs. For decades, he's practiced what he's preached, starting with TAP in 1965, was just the beginning. Like legal aid, like the CHIP program. We started all those programs. And then 10 or more nonprofit organizations in the Royal Valley that we spun off independently that are now working independently all started with TAP. And it doesn't end. Instead of retiring when he sold his business, Brand said he just changed jobs changed his focus. And the equal opportunity, we want and expect our children and their children to inherit. His recent book sums up the issues Brand spends his life working on. So that's, that's why I wrote my book, uh, about why everybody needs to get involved in local things. And usually that leads to bigger things. My experience has been to get really involved in local things that sometimes have national implications and help and so forth. So that's what I've been doing. A way of working from the ground up. Presenting the Community Impact Hero Award is Susan Lucas, Executive Assistant at Delta Dental of Virginia. On behalf of the Delta Dental of Virginia Board of Directors, our President and CEO, Dr. George Levinke, and our 200 employees here at Roanoke, we thank you for all that you have done to make the Roanoke Valley a better place to live and work. And we are honored to present this award to Mr. Cabell Brown, the Community Impact Award. Thank you.